Ball start against the Lions is going to be the call. I'm moving back five yards, make it a fourth down and ten. Check that fourth down about nine. Looks like Kate Jackson in pump formation for the Lions. Gets the snap, gets the kick away. Looks like he's going to kick away from the Gator returners. He's going to take a mount out of roll and it's going to roll dead at about the 31 yard line of the Gators, first and 10. First and 10 for the Gators from their own 30 yard line. Chance and Chase Grove split out for the Gators. Kyron Beatty, the Gator quarterback. Handoff goes up the middle. That's number 20, Chase. Boy, tough running. Going to get about eight yards on that carry. My stop might have been made by number 71, Kirkland Sorrel for the Lions. Going to bring up a second down and one for the Gators. Ball spotted at their own 39-yard line. Beatty pitches out to number three, Isaac Carver. Carver looking for some room. Well played by the Lions defense. He's going to be stopped for no gain. That's number 14, Kate Jackson out there defensively. Also, uh, number 63, Oscar Pindo for the uh, Lions. Going to bring up a third down and one for the Gators. The ball spotted at their own 39-yard line. Handoff goes up the middle. Chase Boyd, boy, gets across the 50 into line territory about the 48 yard line. Fine run by Chase Boyd. The Pindo, I believe, was on the stop for the uh, Lions. We got a penalty marker down. Penalty marker up top. So we'll wait and see what the officials tell us. Sideline warning uh, against the Lions is the call, just a uh, just a sideline warning, so no no penalty marks to be uh, marked off. First and ten for the Gators, ball spotted down at the Lions, 48-yard line. Turner and Chase Gross. Ch check that. Chance Gross split out wide for the Gators. Kyron Beatty pitches out to number seven, Chandler Green. Green looking for some room. He got a good run up to about the 44 yard line of the line. Not exactly sure which one of the lines out there made the stop, came up quickly, stopped the, stopped the run. Pretty good run, though. It's going to be a, a gain of about five yards, maybe four or five yards on the play. So second down, about six for the Gators. Ball spotted down at the 44-yard line. Handoff goes to, it was up the middle. I didn't see exactly who was running. Isaac Carver was on the carry for the game. Just went to get down to the 40 yard line. Going to bring up the third down and about two for the Gators. We got to get down to the Mount Ida 38 yard line for the first down.
Looks like a false start against the Gators is going to be the call. Penalty yards will be marked off and make it a third down and seven for the Gators. Third and seven from the Mount Ida 45-yard line. Uh, Kyron Beatty on the keeper looking for some room. We got a county marker down on the field. We'll have to wait and see. Looks like it's going to nullify. Yeah, going to be a hold against the Gators. Oh my God! Pretty nice run by Kyron Beatty. Would have been first down yardage, but the hold is going to move the Gators back. Penalty yardage from the, the spot of the foul is going to move the Gators all the way back to their own 43-yard line. So it'll be a third down and 19 for the Gators. Third down, 19. Got two men split out to the left for the Gators this time. And off goes up the middle. Gators just going to play it safe there. Chase Boyd on the carry. That's number 63. Hondo on the carry, or on the stop. So it's going to bring up a fourth down for the Gators. Punting situation for the Gators. Okay, Jackson back deep for the Lions. Now Shea Logan in pump formation for the Gators. Let's go, Let's go. Logan snap, gets the kick away. It's going to come down at about the 25-yard line. Fair call by Jackson. It's going to set the lines up first and 10. Let's the ball. Looks like it's going to be the 26-yard line of the Lions, first and 10. And off goes to number 12. Looks like the score, a play they scored on earlier. Going to be a lot better played by the Gators that time. They finally going to force him out of bounds. I believe that was number two over there, Chase Gross. Gators are on the carry that time for the line. Game of about six, going to bring up a second down four. And uh, goes up the middle, well played by the Gators. Number 52, Kevin Kigley getting up off the ball and pile for the Gators making the stop. Going to bring up a third down and about two. Ball spotted down at the 34-yard line of the Lions. Handoff goes up the middle. I believe that's LaGrange on the carry. Good run all the way to the 45-yard line. That's going to set up a first and 10 for the Lions. First 
first and 10 for the Lions. Ball spotted just shy of their own 45-yard line. LaGrange on the carry. Going to be met by a host of Gators. Chris Haywood leading the charge there for the Gators. Gaining about five on that run. It's going to be a second down and five for the Lions. Ball spotted down at their own 49 yard line. Handoff goes up the middle. Nothing there. The Gators played it well. See Nick Moss there. Caleb Kegley. Defensive line doing a good job for the Gators tonight. Looks like maybe a yard on the play. It's going to bring up a third down for the Lions. Third down and about four. Third down and four for the Lions. We got one man split out up top. Pitch out to number 12, Dwyer. And the Gators are going to play it well. They're going to stop him for a loss. Wasn't sure exactly who made the stop over there. Gators pursued well. You want to bring up a fourth down for the Lions. Number three on the stop over there for the Gators, Isaac Carver. Good job by the Gators. Going to put the uh, Lions in a punting situation. K. Jackson gets snapped, gets the kick away, pinning away from the Gator returners once again. Now that's going to go out of bounds, so Gators should be set up with pretty good field position. Looks like we're going to mark it at about the 33, maybe the 34-yard line. First and 10, Gators. <laughs> 